All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. We have defeated Team Skull. I could really use a heal before somebody tries to... Thank you. Do I have to fight you? Do I have to fight this captain right here? Because that's going to be a problem. Oh, no. What's going on guys and welcome back to Pokemon Arcade with episode 5 of the Pokemon Sun Randomizer Ghost Monolock. We'll do a quick team recap for you guys right here at the very start of the episode. We have got Mascot, the Phantump at level 13 as well as a loading screen. <laughs> First Mate, the Drifloom at level 15. They're doing okay. They're doing all right. We haven't done any grinding since the last episode. If you missed last episode, it is up on the channel in a playlist now. Welcome back again. Make sure you guys smash the like button if you're excited. I got to get my energy up. It's early, sort of early for me on a Saturday morning. We're going to be doing some streams later today. You guys have already seen them at this point in the future, but we're just going to hop into it and start exploring the next city in the Alola region. So let's keep going. If you missed last episode, we took on the trainer school and got essentially bodied. Um, I don't know why he's still there. And how and Lily talked to us and said they're going to go ahead and head to the next town. So that is what we're doing as well. We've gotten a couple of encounters. I think we'll get a couple more today. It'll be mostly exploring, and uh, I, I will say it's going to be mostly cutscenes, but also a couple of encounters. So we hope we get it. We do have the Haoli City Beachfront, so that's pretty sick. That means there should be an encounter here if we're able to get one without surfing. Not sure if we will be or not. Also trying something a little bit different with the gameplay today. Hopefully it looks a little bit crispier little bit better I'm recording the uh, the top screen a little bit bigger so I'm hoping it'll shrink down into the layout and look all nice and stuff oh man it's been a week or so since I recorded as well I mean I got a haircut I don't know that it shows up very well uh, it's obviously less long but it's a uh, it's a new haircut I'm excited about it I'm getting ready for PAX East as we've talked about in the last few episodes wanted to look fresh wanted to look clean as I travel through Alola as well, I mean, you know, a fresh cut is always important when you go to the beach. I'm still very much enjoying this game, not having the hard lines. I love how it feels the need to teach me Alola, as if I would not immediately register that that's just Aloha. Oh, look, we get a hidden item to start right out. It is a Pokeball. So my understanding of how 3DS games work, we might have talked about this in a previous episode. I apologize if I have, uh, but essentially... We can't randomize field items, but we can randomize special mart items. So anytime we find one of those marts with two people in it, one of them will have randomized things. But the items that we actually pick up will not be very exciting. You know, now that I'm looking at that Pyukumuku back here, I don't know if you guys registered it, but this Pyukumuku right here. And if you've played Sword and Shield, you've seen Pinchurchin. They're like the same Pokemon. Why are, why are they the... Why? Why? All right, I'm not really concerned with too much here, guys, so I think Lily's going to show us how to get clothes and stuff, but we're probably not going to spend any money on that because it's stupid expensive. Uh, this is an encounter right here, but there's How. How has found us. He stopped us from getting our Howly City encounter. I really hope that we're able to find another ghost type. It'd be really nice to keep fleshing out the team. Uh, it's doing okay so far. I'm enjoying the fact that we have Grass, Ghost, and Flying. I mean, hopefully we can get a... Um, oh, the uh, Sandy Ghast, the... You know, the the one from the uh, the beaches. I really like Sandy Gast. I think the ghost ground typing is pretty good. He did really well for me in my one playthrough of this game. So I'm really kind of excited to get him on the team if we can find one. Another good, you know, we could get a uh, we could get a Gengar. We could potentially get a Mega Gengar. That would be really cool. Who else could we get? We could get... How many ghost types are there? Are there... There's not a lot. But there's, there's a good amount in this game. I want to say when I looked it up, there was like 40 ghost types in this game. So 40 out of 800. <laughs> Not the best chances, but they exist. Thank you. I I forgot about this stupid tutorial. I don't know how this is going to go. Uh, Rotom can take pictures. And it's supposed to be like screenshots and stuff that you can share. I'm not sure how it's going to work for this. The Tourist Bureau. Thank you. My Rotom Dex is upgraded again. I see the wall in the background that we're going to be going to. Oh, look, we get a nice selfie with the three of us. And Lily looks so... Lily's just going. She does not know how to take a good photo, apparently. All right, get out of here. 
I don't want to go shopping. I want to take this photo and get my encounters. I am hoping that we can make it to the first trial in the next like two episodes. That's going to be my goal. I feel like uh, it's moving real slow here at the beginning. But then once we build a team and we get going, we're going to be moving really, really, really fast. And I'm excited about it. All right, let's see a Pikachu. I wish that Alolan... I oh, we could get a Rotom. Uh, we can get a Rotom. We can get a Mimikyu. Ghost types are coming to me now. How do I... R. Is this it? Did I do it? I did it. All right, the circle pad. Uh, bad news for us, guys. I don't have the circle pad mapped. So we're just going to take some pictures and not move at all. It's perfect. There we go. Excellent. Enjoy the clicks. Enjoy our excellent uh, nice shots that we're going to share out, even though that doesn't make sense. This is the weirdest system ever, the fact that there's like social media in the Pokemon world. Although I have to say, I really like that Rotom sprite. Close the Pokefinder. I don't need to save that to an SSD. I don't even think I could. Did I get a good shot? Yes, I did. Thank you. Can I go now? Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Encounter time. What is this area called? We might be able to even get more than one here. I think this is just still Howley City Beachfront. So we're going to check these out really quick. And uh, I will be right back if we manage to find an encounter. Unless this is a ghost type. This is dark type. All right, guys, I'll see you in a second. I'm going to check a couple of these encounters out. I'll speed it up for you like I did in the last episode. Let me know down in the comments, by the way, if you liked that. I figured that would be better than me just randomly commentating over a bunch of encounters. And it makes the episodes be able to get through more things. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. It is a lot of grass to check. See you here in a second. we're back uh nothing in this grass as you guys probably just saw i'm thinking i might go with a, a camera shot angle there rather than the speed up get through it even faster for you guys but we'll see if i did it let me know down in the comments and tell me if you hate it or like it or love it or whatever you want to do but that said we're going to go back through this gate and we're just going to keep on rolling through the town there's some more grass to get it's not our only option we're going to be trying a lot of stuff today but i didn't want to walk past lily and go through all the beautiful clothes shopping without you guys tell me do you pick out all your own clothes i do i do i like this this leaf shirt right here. I don't know if you can see it. Maybe I'll, maybe if I see that in editing, I'll remember to do a zoom, but it's a, it's a nice leaf pattern shirt from the old Navy. Shout out to old Navy. If you want to send me a sponsorship all about that. Here we go. Did she give me a clothes case? I'm not even going to go into that store. I don't think I have to. Do I have to do anything over here? I see we've got more grass. We've got plenty of new grass to go into. And these are not different uh, different places, but they are going to be different encounter tables. So, all right, guys, I'm going to run through these grasses, uh, probably all the stuff right here next to the Pokemon Center, because I don't think we're going to get prompted by anything, and we'll be back in just a second. back again and nothing cool well <laughs> plenty cool there nothing catchable there that mega latios is a pretty common encounter i know you guys just checked that out might have been latios latios i don't know which one it was the purple one the purple mega hopefully i don't get copyrighted for that I'm, i might have low-key had supergirl on while i was going through that uh i think all you got was a couple flying sound effects these folks right here let me turn off speed up are talking about team skull making fun of them thinking they're terrible they are evil they're i mean really team skull is a bunch of numb skulls as they said uh that said let's see if there's any more grass i was trying to find out if there was any more grass over here i don't know if there is there is okay let's go ahead and clear the cut scenes real quick because i know hop is going to say something to us right over here so we'll clear this cutscene, and then i'll make another quick cut check that other types of grass hopefully we can get a howley city encounter um i, I really don't know if we're going to be able to um i wanted to keep the surprise aspect into this randomizer though it might possibly have been a good idea for me to have looked at it in the randomizer uh in the randomizer program to see i think i have to buy a malasada so i'm just gonna buy a malasada i can see the encounters in that program it might have been smart for me to take note 
or had someone take note of how the uh, how the program put them, where they are, where I might even, you know, just had somebody write down like, this route will have one, this route will have one, this route will have one. Could have saved us a lot of time, but you know, it'd be like that sometimes. Uh, I've learning for the future. Uh, I'm actually really enjoying this though, just because I'm enjoying seeing all the different types of Pokemans that we can possibly see here. And now that I am here at this grass, we will take one more final cut and I will check these, put them in here and we'll see if we can get an encounter in this town and I'll be right back. Got one! There's a Howly City encounter after all. It is a Spiritomb. It is level 7. It is female. I'm excited we got one. <laughs> this is the first encounter I had in this grass. Uh, I'm going to go for the Confuse Ray. I'm a little afraid an Astonish is going to kill it. So I'm going to go for the Confuse Ray. And then I'm going to go for the Ingrain. So we've got plenty of health coming in to help us survive here. If we find a Leftovers, it's going to be awesome. That Dark type attack is scary. I do not like that. Let's go to our potions. Okay, we've only got one. All right, guys, this is gonna be tough. Honestly, let's just go for the ball, I think. Ah. All right. Where are the Pokeballs? Whenever I put in the lines T, it gave me a whole bunch of extra items. I need to, I didn't realize they were in the balls pocket. I need to take them out. Here we go. Did we just get that? Yo, we got it. We got a team of three. We're killing the game. We're doing awesome. I don't even know what I was about to say there. 2006 Spiritomb on the team. I'll level that up between, uh, episodes and you know doing cool stuff like that uh since we are starting to get more traction here on the channel and i know this isn't a charmander but i can't get a charmander in a ghost only lock and shiny char has been coming out like crazy i just tried to click obs to type here we go shiny char has been coming out like crazy to the streams i'm gonna name this spiritomb shiny char after shiny char lizard if you're watching this i hope you i hope you like spiritomb i, th I think it'll be cool to Try to shout out some of the new people on the channel, make them feel a little bit more involved. Uh, give you a little bit more encouragement to watch the recorded series, as I know I'm still learning the commentary aspect of it right now. So, it is what it is. So yeah, as I mentioned before in that last cut, I was actually watching uh, Supergirl, the new episodes of Supergirl, while I was uh, doing that encounter-ish type thing. Because it doesn't take a little bit of time. I mean, we got about 21 minutes episode, and I think about 5 minutes of that is cut out encounter time. And I, I gotta say, I'm really enjoying it. I really enjoyed the Crisis on Infinite Earth crossover with the CW. And I'm curious if any of you guys watch it at home and what you think about it. Okay, so this is not a special mart, I guess. Um, it looks like... Well, that's not fun. Okay. Looks like I didn't get them randomized or it didn't work. Uh, it'd be like that sometimes. Luckily, money is not a problem in this game, so we're going to go ahead and buy a whole bunch of medicine because we were out there. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Looks like there's anything else we want to do here. I'm not... We have we have the little flag on the map, so we'll just have to go check it out and see what we're doing. Because I thought I just bought a Malasada for Hop, but then Hop didn't do anything with it, so... Not sure what's happening there. Random police officer staring at a wall. Sounds about right. Going to the marina. Got it. He wants us to go to the marina. Is there something in here? Is there another item I can pick up? We had another encounter table, so that's good. Surely there's an item in here. Yes. That seemed like echoed voice. Okay, that could be a move that sounds like someone might be able to learn. Uh, I'm going to try to avoid getting an encounter since we don't need it. And we get super lucky and make it out. Awesome. Oh boy, I, I want to talk more about Crisis on Infinite Earths because I've been watching a lot of it and catching up on the CW shows with like season 5 of Supergirl and season 6 of The Flash and the end of Arrow and everything. But uh, And that's not really a spoiler because they've been announcing that on TV for months. Uh, but I can't talk too much about it because I don't, I don't want to be spoiling everybody. I don't want to be that guy. So, Alright, I guess we'll just keep coming down here to the marina. Doesn't seem like there's much else to do here. 
We're not going to a new island already, so what, what's happening? This is Ilama. Or Iyama? I'm not sure. Ilama, Iyama, we'll figure it out at some point. I, actually, I probably won't figure it out. I played through this game once already. There's the blurry team skull. This is one of those screens that's trying to do 3D, and I don't know why, because I have 3D off. And it did not like that. So I apologize whenever you can see like that extra layering of people there. It 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 I can't get rid of it. I've tried. I tried. I blew the content quality up and everything. But yeah, we're getting through it. Alright, what's up, kids? Let's fight. I'm trying to fight you, but you won't talk to me. There we go. I want I don't remember if we end up having to fight the second person or not. That is that's not a trial, Captain. That's the dude that takes me to the last island, I think. That's a Zen mode Darmanitan. Why is Darmanitan Zen mode? Just naturally. Why? Psychic type. I'm going to set up the ingrain. Oh, he's only got one Pokemon. Probably should have just went for the Astonish. I assumed he was going to have two Pokemon. That was not good. Uh, I just tried to look over here like it was going to be showdown and it was going to show me what it was. Um, that was not good. I'm going to heal so I can see what move that was. I was not paying enough attention. And see if he can do more. Because I think he kills. Incinerate. Yes. He does 20 damage. We have exactly 20 health. So we have to... We have to switch. Luckily, with Shiny Char being low level, that sucks if I have to sack it off. But we have a Pokemon that is lower level that can take a hit if we ever need it to. Uh, incinerate will not do nearly as much to first mate so first mate can try to make a go of it let's go ahead and astonish here astonish should be super effective because it's fire psychic and zen mode and we get the 30 percent flinch so that's we're okay okay we're gonna make it out we're gonna make it out excellent and we outspeed which is awesome um i know we're going to kill it so i'm not gonna waste the astonish because we might want it it's our stab move you know that sort of a thing it just goes, ooh, just falls over. I was like, why is fire type super effective on us? We're ghost type. It's ghost grasp. Come on, Jordan. He's very nice when you beat him. He's just like, nice to meet you. Good, good job, everybody. Excellent. Here's some money. Here's some clothes. Here's a new Pokemon. Take, go ahead and take the keys to my house. Go ahead and uh, just, just. Just take whatever you want. Do you want do you want my kids? Do you want my car? Do you want my dog? Like, what, what can I do for you, really? I mean, just take it. It's like we're playing a different game. That's very fourth wall. We don't need that kind of fourth wall here. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's do this. We have defeated Team Skull. I could really use a heal before somebody tries to thank you. Do I have to fight you? Do I have to fight this captain right here? Because that's going to be a problem. Oh no. Oh no. I don't I don't he's gonna have six Pokemon, I think. Let's do it. This might be a mistake. We might die here. We might die here. I'm pretty sure important trainers are gonna have six Pokemon. Uh so we're gonna we're, we might get bodied. It really just depends. He's got some good dark types. We're in trouble. For sure. Let's figure it out. Wow, I wish he had found a Mega Gengar right now. Okay, he doesn't have six Pokemon. That's good for us. It would be really sick if we had a freaking grass type move right now. But hopefully he won't have anything super, super, super bad against us. I want to go for the ingrain turn one. He, he definitely went for the lower, so that's not good. Let's go for the Confuse Ray. Get the Confuse Ray on him. We've got the healing on our side. We're going to Growth. Oh, he full healed. Interesting. So our attack and special attack is up. He's no longer confused. We've got healing. I'm gonna I'm gonna ingrain. Did I just hit ingrain again? No, I hit confuse ray. I don't know if it worked or not. I'm just gonna go for the astonish. Ooh, pursuit's really bad for us, but we know he's got it now. I'm gonna go for one more growth. Because it's gonna come in handy against that second Pokemon. He hit himself. We know we're going to kill on the next move. We've got almost two-thirds of our health. This is going to be a... 
I see. I want to rely on mascot, but I feel like Drifloon is a better Pokemon at this point in the game. Um, I like Trevenant a lot, but I'm worried that uh, my combative memory, my, my memory of him as a combative friend and and good Pokemon is going to be very skewed. I think that's not good. Um, that's really not good. An Arcanine is. An Arcanine is going to have Fire Fang as a level 1 move, I'm pretty sure. So basically, this is our only Pokemon to take him out. Of course, he knocks our attack down. Why wouldn't he? Um, I think we go for the Minimize strats, do a bunch of Minimizes, heal as best we can. Uh, I think we have a Burn Heal. I'm going to Minimize again. We're going to go... I think that raises us two stages. So we'll be able to heal up here. And then just just try to live, basically. Uh, we do have burn heals, so that's good. But we're going to go for a potion right now. This Arcanine, unless he misses, is definitely going to cause us to probably to have to sack Pokemon. This is really bad. Okay, we know we can live a burn. We, or we know we can live that, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get rid of the burn. Ember has very low burn chance. I don't know exactly what it is, but I'm, I know Ember's burn chance is very low. Uh, we'll heal up, uh, and then we'll probably go on the attack. These 10 potions were a really good idea. I really, I, I don't, we're going to get caught out like this a couple of times, I'm sure, because I, I was not ready for that. All right, let's go for Gust. Let's go for the Stab Gust. Our attack is down. I forgot our attack is down. Even better, let's just get our Minimize. Let's just get our Accuracy Evasion all the way up. Let's, let's try to avoid the, the absolute best we can. I, I didn't want to do that. We're, we're already maxed. Good job, me. All right, I'm, I'm going to click a little bit now so I don't make that same mistake. You are a physical move as well. You are a... F oh, Gust is special. That's good. Gust is special, so we're actually not lowered in that stat. It's going to be a four-hit KO. Uh, I'm a little worried about the crit, so I'm going to go ahead and just use the potion. Like I said, money is easy to come by in this game, so I don't want to... Uh, I don't want to take the risk that we're going to lose just because I was being stingy with my potions. I would much rather spend that money... Uh, he did hit us, so we probably would have used it this turn. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bank. Oh, he avoided. How did he avoid? Just randomly? Is it? Gus must be 95% accuracy or something. Okay, we outspeed, but I'm not gonna take the chance that we miss again. Potion again. Fingers crossed, guys. Fingers crossed. I, I'm glad I didn't go with the important, po important battles have six thing because that would have been a pain in the butt. We would almost certainly have lost here. This Arcanine is. Woo, it's strong. It's it's up there. I honestly, I wanted to record another episode after this, but I I very much think that I will probably need to grind up Spiritomb so we have three Pokemon before the next episode. <laughs> okay, we're not burned. He's he, very likely to miss. He potioned. I hope he's only got one potion. What is the accuracy on Gust? It's 100. Why are we missing? Why are we missing? Okay, what's up with Constrict up here? It's 10... I, I, does it, is Constrict one of the ones that goes, I don't think so, I don't think Constrict works multiple times, so I'm not going to worry about it, it's not like Wrap, uh, if it was Wrap, that'd be awesome, I don't know what he did, but somehow we're missing Gusts, and I have no idea how we could be missing Gusts, I guess maybe you can just avoid sometimes, but we're plus six accuracy, and this man has hit like the last three embers, and that's starting to make me a little bit angry, like, I, I don't know what's happening here. Hopefully he doesn't have any more potions because we'll be able to kill him with two gusts. Oh, we killed him with one gust. We got a high roll. We did it. Claps, 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 claps. I can't a pause. Maybe I'll, I'm going to, you know what? 32. Celebration sound effects. We need them. We need them. We won. I thought we were going to lose. First mate is learning payback. That is a good move. Tell me, tell me the things. Yeah, that's 50 physical if the user moves after the target the power doubles because that, that could be a 100 100 base power move uh, i'm never going to use constrict I, I i won't almost certainly i'll never will all right i turned on care what's up anybody else go up shiny char made it to level nine that's awesome that's going to cut down on my grinding time really excited about that and then let's come in here and i think we want the brush Yes, 
we will brush them off. Like I said, the first time we did this, I would really like to focus on this sort of thing so that we make sure our Pokemon love us and therefore will dodge attacks and get random stat boosts and do super cool stuff like that. All right, let's give you a bean. What kind of bean would you like? Let's go with blue this time. Watching Drifloon eat is so cute. He's just like, oh, oh, oh. It's like a goldfish. All right. Using the mouse. We're learning. We're doing the thing. All right. You, or should I say your Pokemon, are quite the intriguing team. Well, thank you very much. I bid you Alola. They lean into it hard. They lean into it hard. Well, all right, guys. We are going to wrap it up here. That was an exciting episode. We had a new Pokemon. We took on sort of, kind of a, uh, sort of, kind of a trial thing. Sorry, I hit the microphone. I'm going to raise the microphone because I'm clapping in front of it too. All right, guys, I'll catch you back here in the next one for episode six on Thursday. If you enjoyed, make sure to smash the like button. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and I'll uh, link some cool videos here in the outro for you guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.